This is homework, uh... MTS Pre-Cal. So pre... Oh my goodness, this writing sucks. Pre-Cal. Um, and then this is homework 1.1 Okay. Um, we plotted the points already. We plotted the points 3, 2, 4, negative 1, negative 2, 3, and negative 5, 4. Negative, no, that's not right. Let's see here. Negative five, negative five, negative four. You should probably not highlight those, man. It's kind of hard to see. Okay. Negative five, negative four. That was the only one I messed up on, right? I plotted that one for some reason. So don't do this. Okay. All right, and it says change the sign to the y coordinate in each of the points uh, in part A and plot these new points. Okay. So basically, they're going to take these points and they're going to change the y coordinate, which is going to flip it across the x axis. Yeah. So the two becomes a negative two, the one negative one becomes a one, and we can show that by changing these to blue. So this is gonna be here, this is gonna be here. Uh, this is gonna be down here, and this is going to be up here. Right? Okay. And so then um, it wants to explain how the points A and B and A and negative B are graphically related. Well, they're graphically related because they reflect across the X axis. x-axis. Okay. Um, and so now we look at 15. Determine whether or not it's a, if it's a function. That's pretty simple. Um, 15 is not a function if x comes up twice. Does X come up twice? So in other words, does X come up twice in here? Does X come up twice in here? Does X come up twice in here? Okay. We notice right away that it comes up twice here and here. Okay, take a look. What are you confused about? It's not, it's not a function if x comes up twice. No x's are the same, that means it's a function. x and x are the same, right? So this is not not a function. Okay? Did you finish 13? 
Yeah, he already finished 13. What the hell? 13 is over here. That's it. They both balance those cross x axis. 